Hi, we are Jacob and Maggie. We live in our camper van, our birdhouse. Join us on our adventures as we travel along the Mediterranean coastline looking for a property to homestead. We left camping Faltos at Parca. We are going to the beach the young Danish couple have recommended us. Ajo Dianakis. It is listed as location in the middle of nature, which usually means park at the risk of being turned away by the police or locals. So we followed their advice. But first, did Jacob tell me to turn right here?
Hi. Still here? That's good news. But really, really hope that you enjoy watching our videos. Um, but we could use your help, please. It's very simple. Just subscribe to our channel and um, hit the bell icon to be notified of any upcoming episodes. And then we'll make sure that we'll have an episode for you ready next week. Thanks very much. We are off to a new real estate agent we made first contact with. He is situated at Preveza. His name? Christos Bovelos. From our earlier research we discovered that there is a lot of land for sale around Preveza, mainly agricultural. The land around Preveza is fertile because it is situated around an inland sea, the Ambracian Gulf. From Christos Bovelos we have also learned that it's allowed to park our birdhouse along Preveza's long coastline just outside the city center. We arrive at sunset. We are welcomed by many amphibians. I wanted to film the croaking creatures, so I took the camera but forgot that my shadow was the great frog silencer. We are still in debate of a Sarikiniko.
Next morning, we drive to Preveza. Speak with the agent, visit the plot he has in portfolio, and once again find ourselves in great despair. We are starting to realize how all the agents operate. While they are very friendly and very professional in their approach, they tend to offer us their leftovers. The plots they can sell, so to speak. The obsolete plots. Not saying we do not understand this. It's the same as the supermarket, displaying their oldest product in front row. Only just now we see the pattern. We have been dead wrong in our approach. This is not how it works, apparently. Meanwhile, I don't feel well. I'm getting more anxious by the day. I have a non-functioning thyroid, which makes life extremely difficult. But I'm holding up against all odds. But we are determined to go on. We have just started. Our aim is still to reach the Peloponnese. In preparation for this journey, we have pinpointed many possible dream plots there. But we are in no hurry. Let's go visit an island nearby. Let's go to Lefkada. We have always been fond of islands. We have many happy memories of the island Kavdos. But maybe we will tell this story some other time. We arrive at Desimi. Looking for a camping? Come to our place! A toothless man on a motorbike shouts. We follow him. We are lured inside. And before we know it, we are trapped. Tassimi Bay offers wonderful views. From dusk till dawn, it is a magnificent place to be. But as the season progresses, so does the amount of campers. From our point of view, this will be the last time we spend a night in a place like this. Okay, it is safe and we can do our laundry, but it does not compare to the tranquility of the place we were yesterday. As I was filming the dazzling display of cramped up neighbors, we once again unexpectedly bump into an acquaintance. Herman van den Belt, the Dutch dealer from whom we bought our camper van. We told him about our Montenegrin adventure. We told him about the missing hook. Remember, we got stuck in the Montenegrin mud? The owner baffled that we didn't know where our hook was? That's yours, huh? No, it's from um, sir. You don't have it by yourself, no? No. Maybe it works. Where is the where is the trunk or, or a place from the parts of the of the of the? I wouldn't be able to tell you. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> no problem. No problem. But I don't know. So the hook. Herman told us where the hook is. There is a box. I can't get it out. Okay, I think it's in the front because in the back it wasn't possible. Yeah. What the hell? <laughs> <laughs> what, what is, is that? This? Careful with your hands. What is this? <laughs> never saw it before. We've never. <laughs> How stupid is that? Ah. ah! This is the hook. There's the hook. This Let's try the hook. Let's try it. Let's try it. Okay. Incredible. What I remember it was here. Here, yeah, there's a here's my screwdriver. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. 
Can you see it? Yeah, yeah, I know. I've, I've been here before. Uh, well, well, well. Okay. Mystery solved. <laughs> Ja, je was hier gisteren tot 12 uur uh, een, een partij die uh, keihard muziek te draaien. Dat ja, daar wordt niet grappig van. Hè? Nee, ja. Ja. hij zit alleen in de muziek, dus dat is verstoord in je gedachte. Oh, als je er gebeden hebt, dan kunnen ze zijn. Ja, ja. zo'n prachtig huisje. Ja. Als je alles op de vorm legt. Ja. Had een mooi dagje met elkaar. Met de boot uh, met Mick en Sini. Ja, ja. 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 dat vind ik heel leuke restaurantjes. Dat vind prachtig mooi zitten als ik de avond vaar. So we are driving behind the father of the dealer where we bought our camper van and we met him here in Lefkada. What are the odds? Uh, the way out of this Westminster. We're living in a bird house. We're driving to the sunny side.